after 7 o'clock, 39 degrees. A couple of lucky Colts fans are headed to Dallas, Texas today to represent the team <laughs> in the NFL draft. It's so much fun. Each of them is getting an all-expense-paid trip and truly the experience of a lifetime, especially for them being super fans. Emily Kinzer is here in the newsroom. Emily, I know you spoke to one of them ahead of the trip. He's at the airport now just waiting to board that flight. Yeah, certainly an, an exciting few days for both of these guys, but specifically Matt because I talked to him. When it's game day, Matt Schroeder and his two kids turn into what they call the Legion of Blue, transforming in a decked out super fan covered in Colts blue from head to toe. He's become quite popular among the fans and so much so the Colts decided to send him to the draft. Take a listen. This is the, uh, the battle gear football pants complete with horseshoes. It's the morning before Colts fan Matt Schroeder flies to Dallas for the trip of a lifetime. Here is all the makeup. This is where the, the crazy artwork comes in. He packs carefully, <laughs> making certain to leave nothing behind. You know, got to have all your Colts gear with you. He's been a Colts fan for a long time. I became a, a Colts fan in the early 90s with uh, Jim Harbaugh. It was just one of those, you know, comeback stories that you had to love. Each year becoming more loyal than the year before. This is my team. I love everything they're about. On game days, he transforms into an all out super fan known as the Legion of Blue. I chose a theme that it mimics an old wrestling tag team from the 80s. Decked out in a full Colts costume with his son and daughter right by his side. For your eight and 10 year old to, to be, you know, in pictures with so many people and make them smile and high fives, and it's a great bonding experience. He's not only caught the eye of other fans, but but the Colts too. Who's going to on TV kind of capture and, and, and who are our fans going to recognize as, you know, oh, that's super fan or that's Legion of Blue. Um, that's how we kind of settled on, on those two because we felt like they really, one, they embody, you know, our fan base and the passion. Matt says this is an experience he never expected. Having not met Mr. Ursay, but people just talk about, you know, his generosity and, and the whole organization for that matter, sending a lunk like me to, you know, represent Indiana to the rest of the nation. The, that's, that's pretty cool. With each passing season, no matter the score, no matter the record, Matt's blood runs blue. They have this high standard that makes me want to stick with Colts Nation through, you know, through a one in one in 15, 16 season, whatever it is, I'm, I'm there. Matt will fly out this morning at 8 o'clock for Dallas. He says he's expecting it to be chaotic where they're all going to be around uh, with all the other super fans around the country. Now, one of the things that's really neat that's happened before the trip, he says he's connected with a lot of different teams and fans from across the country, and they want to get together and take a big selfie. He says now it's all fun and games and friendly before the season, and then, of course, when the season starts back, uh, the rivalry will be on. Absolutely so. The timeout for the time is nice. It is uh, 714 right now. One of the country's